I set up a business called Tree to My Door, which sees me grow a range of trees, package them up as gifts, and send them out in their own eco-friendly boxes. I've worked really hard to set up a new business which has allowed me to make the most out of what I'm passionate about. My grandfather grew up on a farm and he took every opportunity to get back out to the countryside and to share his knowledge and respect of nature with me during my childhood. We used to visit his brothers working farm together um, and harvest natural traditional seaweed snacks called dulls during the summer. Uh, we used to make blackthorn walking sticks and pick mushrooms and nuts around harvest time. The autumn is the season that I have the fondest memories of. The season when we would venture out to what we call the nut braes, which were beautiful wooded hillsides where hazel trees grew amongst gently flowing streams and moss covered rocks. We used to walk from tree to tree, shaking each one to encourage ripe hazelnuts to fall to the damp woodland floor, where I would gather them into plastic bags until we filled each one and returned back home to crack open and eat our natural treasure. One of my most vivid memories is of a midsummer's evening uh, when I was in my teens uh, when I decided to walk through a particularly dense part of woodland uh, just as dusk was drawing. I stopped walking and paused because up ahead I heard a slight noise. Standing as still as I could, I tried to breathe really quietly. All of a sudden I watched as a vixen appeared ahead of me with bright eyes staring directly at me. Then four or five of our own fox cubs bounded out from the undergrowth. The fox came closer and closer towards me until they walked around my own feet. And as they continued on their way through the woodland, uninterrupted by my presence. This is one of the most magical encounters of my life and nature. As I grew up, my fascination and respect for nature continued. I told the careers advisor at high school that I wanted to work as a forest ranger, but I actually ended up studying marketing at university. After that, I worked for two years before deciding to set up my own company that would provide trees as gifts. I wanted to buy a tree as a gift, but I couldn't find what I was looking for, so I thought it was a good idea to start up my own business doing just that. So I combined my marketing skills and experience with my love for nature and trees. This has allowed me to live a fulfilling life which contributes to a natural world that I'm happy to live in.